Today I'm going to learn to make one of the most traditional dishes here in Dalmatia called Pekka and the best place to start is the Green Market. Dobre jutro! Dobre jutro! Hi! How are you? Good! I'm ready to go shopping. So if we're going to make Pekka today, what are the ingredients that we need? We need uh, carrots, onions uh -huh. and potatoes. Carota! Carota! <laughs> Hola. Hola. Okay. It's the best to buy fruits and vegetables from the oldest lady and the ugliest one. So <laughs> <laughs> that's the way you know it. it's going to be uh, homegrown and fresh. So now just potatoes? Yeah. Well, let's get them from this nice young gentleman. Uh, <laughs> Super. It definitely beats going to the supermarket. <laughs> yeah, you can see there's plenty of everything. And then the main thing, the meat, is we're going to have... We can decide for the meat or for the octopus. If we are having octopus, then we are going to the fish market. Okay, I think we should have octopus. Yes, of course. Okay. So let's no. go there. You think they always have octopus or...? Um... Okay, so... We're too late to the fish market. If we can't have octopus, what should we have? We can go straight here outside to the meat shop and buy it from there. You just know this, how much meat to buy? No, I call my father. Okay. <laughs> Let's hope they have some veal. Looks like we have it all. Yeah. Is your brother prepared to teach someone how to make Pekka? He is. <laughs> all right, let's head to the house. You have your own room for Pekka. <laughs> yeah. So what's the process? What do we need to do first? Uh, we first start, start fire. So this is a typical oven. Keeps in the aroma. Yes, that's why it's, it tastes so good. It's hot. Yeah, fire is on. We can prepare? We can prepare meat and everything. They were all out of octopus. Think that's enough for the whole family? Yeah, yeah, of course. Put a little salt. Yeah, you bought a lot of meat. Should I do all the carrots or...? No, no, just one, two. Well, we've got five or six. <laughs> <laughs> Now I put uh, the bell on to get warm. Oh, and then you put the hot coals on top. Okay, let's peel those potatoes. That's a lot of potatoes. I will help you with that, of course. Look who's arrived. Hello. Mama came to the rescue. The pro has entered. Look at her. She had a whole life to practice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so who taught you how to make Pekka? My father. Your father, uh-huh. Looks all right. Do we have your approval? Okay. So for a long time they've been making pekka here in Dalmatia, yeah? Yeah, this is a, like traditional uh, dish. So you let the fire go for about an hour, yeah? And then you heat in the bell, center it up, perfect. And then you cover it all with yes. the hot coals. And how long do we need to let it cook? Hour and a half, two hours. Now we wait. Yeah. It's hotter in here, I think, than it is outside. Here's the beer. <laughs> <laughs> to making and learning how to do pekka <laughs> from <Okay>. the pros. <laughs> really, Marco. Really. <laughs> how hot do you think it is? 42. Beer's never tasted so good. <laughs> the time has come. Our peck is ready, yeah? Thanks for having me in your home, Julie. Marco, thank you. Mm. The iron is the trick to why Pekka tastes so good. A young lady is waiting somewhere for you, Marco. Mm. Very good. Days like this are the reason beer was invented, I think. 